a sense of irony has played out through this whole thing today as this shooting investigation unfolded at Virginia Tech. Officials were in Washington over the last shooting. That's right. Uh, the U.S. Department of Education had fined them $55,000 for not notifying students in a timely manner. Our Melanie Woodrow is following developments right now on that part of the story at our newsroom. Melanie? Exactly. As you said, it was following that 2007 incident, of course, in looking back at the incident, that it really came out whether or not students were notified in time so that they could properly react. We have some video here that we can show you of the 2007 shooting incident at Virginia Tech. Since that incident, the schools made a number of changes, including now sending text messages, emails, tweets, and posting things on its website, its Facebook page, so that it could notify students using all of the technology that a college-age student would use today. We've been following a lot of those notifications on Virginia Tech's Facebook page ourselves today, getting some of our information that we've been sharing with you from that page. So as you said, coincidentally or not, there was that hearing today on Capitol Hill where Virginia Tech officials were appealing a $55,000 fine by the U.S. Education Department in connection to their response following the 2007 shooting rampage. Of course, they were contesting that fine. It went before a judge. No outcome from that just yet, but here we were today, of course, dealing with a somewhat similar but different incident. And as the timeline came out today, we heard about it, I believe it was about 1237 or so, but police were saying that that first shooting was around 1215. So it may have taken about 15 or 20 minutes for the students to be notified via text message. I imagine we'll hear more about this in the coming days, guys.